ready? So we need to talk about exhaust. I don't think I've even told any of you this. So the other weekend I took off my factory NPP exhaust system off of the Grand Sport. And that's because I have a brand new aftermarket exhaust in. Um, this one is made by Speed Engineering. So I was excited to put it on and unfortunately it does not fit. It doesn't even fit in the nearest universe of fitting. Now what do I mean by that? I mean that one side is too short, the other side is way too long, um, it needs to be cut up, bent up, fabricated some new pipes, which is all very frustrating because I spent about probably a good hour and a half taking off that factory system off of my car because it's a pain in the ass to get that off of a transaxle car. So the temporary solution right now for this system being off and that system waiting to be fabricated on the car, I have gone through the liberty of putting dumps on the car after the mid pipe here. Now to make it clear, I gave you guys all of that backstory because this is a temporary solution. Let me say it one more time for you guys. This is a temporary solution for my exhaust. I know there's gonna be people out there that wanna know how a dump sounds on a Corvette. So that's the purpose of this video today. All right, I'm not really sure where I should be putting the uh, camera here for the exhaust, but we're just gonna go ahead and have it right there. Y'all need a cold start on this guy. It's time for you guys to see what it's like to drive this thing around with dumps coming out of the mid pipe. I can tell you right now, it's not super pleasant in here. It is stupid loud, um, but it drones quite a bit, especially at 2K RPMs. Hopefully you guys can hear what I mean by that. I'm gonna drive it with both the windows down and the windows up so you guys get a taste of both of it. All right, here we go. the GoPro can pick that up but it's uh it's already giving me a headache I can't be the only one that hates driving around with a GoPro on their head I feel like everyone's looking at me especially when I'm uh when I'm fishbowling it with uh, no tint on this car I need to tint these windows we'll get a nice little light acceleration going here myself a headache right now for YouTube you're welcome because I'm giving myself a headache for you guys make sure you leave a like on this video all the uh, the loudness from the drone shut up shaker bottle I think it le makes less noise on the floor over there Siri 
seriously guys leave a like for me uh, I'm gonna have to go home and take some uh, Advil or something for my head I am curious though what do you guys think of the noise do you like the dumps do you think it sounds good I will say this apart from the drone I do love how loud it is and obnoxious. I, I like my car as loud and obnoxious and it sounds really good when you're on it. It's just everywhere else it just doesn't sound that great, you know? When you're on it, it sounds fantastic. Everywhere else though, it's just loud, it's droney, it's kind of like truck-like sounding too. I don't know how to describe that. All right, of course, regardless, I know you guys want an acceleration where I'm just completely on it. Full tilt, giving it all the beans. So that's what I'll give you. I think I'll leave the windows down. I think that will be the, uh, the best experience for you guys. Hopefully it's not too much wind noise. That way I probably have less drone as well too. thumbs up. Wow. <laughs> uh, I think people from halfway across the state can hear that. Oh my god, that's loud. Another negative thing about these dumps that I'm starting to figure out too, you're gonna start developing some new rattles in your car. I have a rattle over here that I did not have before, that I have now. No bueno. No bueno. Okay, so that was a C6 Corvette with dumps. Now stick around, we do have some racing videos with a very, very similar car to this one and another certain Mustang. Uh, you'll see those later. Hang around for another 30 seconds or so. But I hope I was able to give you a little bit of insight on how dumps would sound on your C6 Corvette. I don't think there's gonna be a lot of people that are in between on dumps. You either love it or you hate it. I'm on the side of basically hating it just because my head is killing me right now. Don't get me wrong. I love loud cars and I do love when I'm on this thing fully, but 99% of the time you're not with these type of cars, you know? So maybe for a strictly race car, do it. For everyday driving, just buy a nice exhaust system.